Alright, everybody, welcome to the Brothers War pre-release, uh, if you didn't watch the other one. So, again, we have, uh, this, this one I'm opening to today is Mishra's Burnished Banner, and, uh, there's another one, which is Urza's Iron Alliance. They're identical, apparently, other than the packaging. Uh, so we'll see. We'll see what happens. We got Rick here. He's able to make it today. Difference is, uh, I get red tokens, you get green tokens. Yeah, yeah, my uh, tokens just immediately went in the garbage, so. I opened a red one and got a green die. So, last night I opened a red one and got a purple die, and I opened a green one today and got a purple die. <laughs> I mean, I'm not upset. Uh, where's this command? I mean, someone's gonna flame you regardless. I don't know what any, most of these I things I should say do, but. I, I'm assuming commander card. I don't know. Uh, no, I think that was actually decently playable. That's the return one. Oh, yeah. yeah. You discard, yeah. you can put stuff the one, yeah, one, two, and three drop. Yeah. I don't know. I might gotta show you. Alright, so let's see what we get here. Oh, yeah. Well, that's pretty good. Oh, and they do have the uh, yeah, they, throwback yeah, ones in here. Yeah, they're in. There's one in every one. Okay. Uh, Razor Lash Transmogrant. Okay. And a. Uh, a precursor goon. Okay. I mean, that's actually So the actual really precursor goon? Okay. The, yeah. And you can play them. It, yeah. No, I so. There's one of the other uh, prototype cards. It's basically oh, precursor, golem. precursor golem. What we were talking last night, we weren't sure if you were actually able to play the, these cards in the set. No. Or like in pre release. So I had to look it up. Wasn't Obstinate Valith a rare before? Yes. So I, think there's I like thought three so. Different Urza's in this. There's a lot of artifacts. Huh. Are One there? with the multiverse. You may look at the top card of your library anytime. You may play lands and cast spells from the top of your library. Once during each of your turns, you may cast a spell from your hand or the top of your library without paying its mana cost. And it costs eight. Can we play ramp? It's future sight with more steps. Ivory tower. Plus. Plus. <laughs> I guess I should do that too, huh? Like I should actually play. Like, hey, these are the rares that I got. I didn't get a Mishra's Law. Not That's that it's not worth bad. as I mean, the original Ice Age ones were what, 20 something at one point? Yeah. So, what in this set doesn't have a magic pack? The uh, meld cards. Oh, okay. That's right. Yep. <laughs> I mean, some I, people were like, why does this say, like, star star on the bottom? Yep. Yeah, there, are, just, there are some meld cards. I just threw it off. There's a... Hold it. Nice. Okay, look at this. You ready? See the, see the coloring? Oh. Yeah. That is awesome. And you can see the actual, like, lines mm -hmm. from the roller. Oh, you can feel the lines from the roller. I had... Matt, you gotta see this. I had a... You gotta see this. Um... In Dominaria, I had the original Dominaria. Same I had thing. it happen across four of my rares that were in a box. Ready? Oh, I had that happen to cool, cool. some of the cards I opened. Ready? Nice, nice. You can feel yeah. the roller marks. And yeah. then it kind of continues over onto this one. That's but. cool. So I was opening all the pre-release kits. And you know how people always complain when their nice. booster box is like dented a little bit or whatever? Mm -hmm. Let me tell you. Watsi does not pad any of these when they ship them to distributors, and distributors also do not pad them. They put four cases in a box that weighs 72 pounds and ship it to you. Look at this kit. I can guarantee all the cards are fine, but people would complain about that. So I'm going to have to sell that at a discount. So I got an Urza's Command. It's in my promo, right? Mm -hmm. so which is cool. Mm -hmm. Got another liquid metal podium, okay. which, is, which okay. is also okay. That's also a foil yeah, mock sample. Nice. You can even play that because you've got a legendary creature, right? I assume you have a legendary creature. Not yet. 
No. Oh. <laughs> but I can play it. It's yeah. An artifact. Yeah. It'll trigger something. Somewhere, maybe. Somehow. I also got this card, which seems dumb, but like, I don't know. Did I get a ready game? Real question is how many millstones did you open? Uh, none so far. None so far. No, wait, that, that, that's the wrong. So the moral of the story is if you are like buying a booster box to like hold on to forever, buy it physically from a store because there is no control over what you get shipped. And also don't complain if you get shipped something and it's dented a little bit. Draconic Destiny. It's a mythic for three. Oh, Chaining creature gets plus one plus one, has flying, yeah, haste, and one. It gets fire breathing. It's a dragon addition to solar types. And when a chaining creature dies, yeah, yeah, return yeah, draconic destiny to its owner's hand. What? Yeah. Every time I read that, and I got it as well. Every time I read it, I read it as draconic density. You know, the whole back to the future thing. Yeah. You, you are my density. Yeah. That's every time I read it. And an inspiring statuary? Dude, okay, I'm like gonna be playing like artifact.deck I think here. And a giant cinder ball. Maybe, maybe. We need uh we need a way to, to get that that amber online here. So I got precursor golem. This was in that Oh, look at that. That's Urza's Command again, which is number three. Oh, hey, look, there's another mythic. Staff of Domination. That seems like a pretty good... Uh, so, okay, so out of these. Yeah. I get to play that. I get to play that. I can't play this. And I get to play that, at least. Seems like a pretty strong... Uh, uh, this doesn't seem horrible. Blue artifacts, because one with... <laughs> I don't know, like, maybe I can ramp I some power stones or something. Like, yeah, that doesn't seem horrible. Oh, I still have another pack to open. Yeah. Oh, wait, I Whoops. My last pack. And I have three Urza's commands, so, like, I get to make three power stones at least. And something else. Oh, a construct artifact. Yeah. Cool. I'm totally, like, forcing blue. Regardless of what's in there. Oh, hey, that's cool. <laughs> Just the random full art Mishra. What's it do? Permit to go have Ward sack a permit. Each artifact card in your graveyard has unearthed three. Okay, maybe I'm in red black. I don't know. Search your library for basic land, reveal it, put it in your hand, then shuffle. Journey your kite. Okay. Okay, well. I guess now I gotta look at these. Oh no, that's a problem. You good? Do you get anything of Do you get anything of note? No, I mean Diabolic Attack. That's about it. Like these, like they're all. I, I got playable that was me. things. This is me last night, yeah. Like they see play. Sure. And I mean I could do some combo-y things maybe with Wellspring, but. I'm gonna probably play this depending on how many artifacts I'm playing. But, yeah, but All right, yeah, well. I mean my uh, my rares are not not great. Oh, this is my last one. Sorry. Shit. I mean, do I, I play blue or do I play Mishra? <laughs> <laughs> I think I play blue here. Yeah. I think. Well, I mean, I, I mean, it depends on what's. Figure in there. it out, but. All right, come on back and see uh, how things go.